Dim sum, Chinese, Dian Xin Pinyin, Dian Xin, Cantonese Yale, Dim Sam, is a style of Chinese cuisine, particularly Cantonese but also other varieties, prepared as small bite-sized portions of food served in small steamer baskets or on small plates. Dim sum dishes are usually served with tea and together form a full tea brunch. Dim sum traditionally are served as fully cooked, ready-to-serve dishes. In Cantonese tea houses, carts with dim sum will be served around the restaurant for diners to order from without leaving their seats. The Cantonese tradition of having endless cups of tea and dim sum is also called yum cha, yin cha which means, drink tea, in Cantonese. History Dim sum is usually linked with the older tradition from yum cha, Chinese, yin cha Cantonese Yale, yam cha, pinyin, yin cha, literally, drink tea, which has its roots in travelers on the ancient Silk Road needing a place to rest. Thus, tea houses were established along the roadside. An imperial physician in the 3rd century wrote that combining tea with food would lead to excessive weight gain. People later discovered that tea can aid in digestion, so tea house owners began adding various snacks. The unique culinary art dim sum originated with the Cantonese in Guangzhou, or Canton, who over the centuries transformed yum cha from a relaxing respite to a loud and happy dining experience. In Hong Kong, and in most cities and towns in Guangdong Province, many restaurants start serving dim sum as early as 5 in the morning. It is a tradition for the elderly to gather to eat dim sum after morning exercises. For many in southern China, yum cha is treated as a weekend family day. More traditional dim sum restaurants typically serve dim sum until mid-afternoon. However, in modern society, it has become commonplace for restaurants to serve dim sum at dinner time. Various dim sum items are even sold as takeout for students and office workers on the go. Cuisine a traditional dim sum brunch includes various types of steamed buns such as cha su bao, a steamed bun filled with barbecue pork, rice or wheat dumplings and rice noodle rolls, which contain a range of ingredients, including beef, chicken, pork, prawns, and vegetarian options. Many dim sum restaurants also offer plates of steamed green vegetables, roasted meats, congee and other soups. Dessert dim sum is also available and many places offer the customary egg tart. Dim sum is usually eaten as breakfast or brunch. Dim sum can be cooked by steaming and frying, among other methods. The serving sizes are usually small and normally served as three or four pieces in one dish. It is customary to order family style, sharing dishes among all members of the dining party. Because of the small portions, people can try a wide variety of food. Dishes Dim sum brunch restaurants have a wide variety of dishes, usually several dozen. Among the standard fare of dim sum are the following. Popular Dumpling, simplified Chinese, Zhao Zi traditional Chinese, Zhao Pinyin, Zhao Zi, Cantonese Yale, Gao. Shrimp dumpling, Sha Zhao Sha Zhao, Ha Gao, steamed dumpling with shrimp filling. Teochew dumpling, chow zhou fen guo, chow zhu feng guo, chu zhao fan guo, steamed dumpling with peanuts, garlic, chives, pork, dried shrimp, and Chinese mushrooms. Xiao long bao, zhao zi xiao long bao, zhao long bao, su lung bao. Dumplings are filled with meat or seafood and are famous for their flavor and rich broth inside. Guosha, guo tai guosha, tip, pan fried dumpling, usually with meat and cabbage filling. Xiao mai, xiao mai, xiao mai, xiao mai, su mai, steamed dumplings with pork and prawns. Usually topped off with crab roe and mushroom. Taro dumpling, yu jiao yu jiao, wuhgok, deep fried dumpling made with mashed taro, stuffed with diced mushrooms, shrimp and pork. Ham sui gok, xian shui jiao, shan shui jiao, ham se wei gok, deep fried dumpling with pork and chopped vegetables. The wrapping is sweet and sticky, while the filling is slightly salty and savory. Dumpling soup, guan tang jiao, guan ting jiao, guntang gao, soup with one or two big dumplings. Rolls, Chinese, wan pinyin, wan, Cantonese yale, gyun. 
spring roll, chun wan chun wan chun wan, chun yun, a deep fried roll consisting of various sliced vegetables such as carrot, cabbage, mushroom and wood ear fungus and sometimes meat. Tofu skin roll, fu pai wan fu pi wan, fuhp gyun, a roll made of tofu skin with various meat and sliced vegetables filling. Rice noodle roll, chong fen changfen, sheangfan, steamed rice noodles, rolled and filled with meats or vegetables inside but can be served plain. Popular fillings include beef, dough fritter, shrimp, and barbecued pork. Often served with a sweetened soy sauce. Bun, Chinese, bao zi pinyin, bao zi, Cantonese Yale, bao. Barbecued pork bun, cha shao bao, cha shao bao, cha su bao, bun with barbecued pork filling. They can either be steamed to be white and fluffy or glazed and baked to golden. The baked variant are called, cha shao kan bao, cha shao kan bao, cha su chan bao. Sweet cream buns, nai huang bao, nai wang bao, nai wang bao, steamed buns with milk custard filling. Pineapple bun, bo luo bao, bo luo bao, bolo bao, literally means pineapple bread. It's a pineapple skin like bread, usually tastes sweet. Cake Chinese, gao pinyin, gao, Cantonese Yale, go. Turnip cake, luo bo gao, luo bo gao, lo baahk go, puddings made from shredded white radish, mixed with bits of dried shrimp, Chinese sausage, and mushroom. They are steamed, then cut into slices and pan fried. Taro cake, yu tu gao yu tu gao, wuh tao go, puddings made of taro. Water chestnut cake, ma ti gao ma ti gao, ma tai go, puddings made of crispy water chestnut. Some restaurants also serve a variation made with bamboo juice. Steamed meatball, niu ru wan niu ru wan, now yuk yun, steamed meatballs served on top of a thin bean curd skin. Phoenix claws, feng jiao feng jiao, feng jiao, deep fried, boiled and then steamed chicken feet with dushi. A plain steamed version is known as white cloud phoenix claws. Bai yun feng jiao bai yun feng jiao, baahk wan feng jiao. Spare ribs, pai gu pegu, pai guat, steamed pork spare ribs with dushi and sometimes garlic and chili. Lotus leaf rice, nuo mi ji nuo mi ji, no my guy, glutinous rice wrapped in a lotus leaf. Typically contains egg yolk, dried scallop, mushroom, and meat, usually pork and chicken. A lighter variant is known as pearl chicken. Zhen zu ji, zhen zu ji, janju gai. Chinese sticky rice, nuo mi fan nuo mi fan, no mai fan, stir-fried, or steamed, glutinous rice with savory Chinese sausage, soy sauce steeped mushrooms, sweet spring onions, and sometimes chicken meat marinated with a mixture of spices including five spice powder. Deep fried squid, yu yu shu yu yu shu, ya yu su, similar to fried calamari, the battered squid is deep fried. Kanji, jo jo, juk, rice porridge such as the Preserved egg and pork porridge. Pai dan shou ru jo, pai dan shoru jo, pai dan sao yuk juk. Sweets. Egg tart, Chinese, dan ta pinyin, danta, Cantonese Yale, dan tot, baked tart with egg custard filling. Tofu pudding, do fu wa du fu hua, da fuh fa, soft tofu served with a sweet ginger or jasmine flavored syrup. Sesame ball, jian dui jia dui, jin dui, deep fried chewy dough with red bean paste filling, coated in sesame seeds. Thousand layer cake, qian saying gao qian saying gao, xinchang go, a dessert made up of many layers of sweet egg dough. Malay sponge cake, ma la gao ma la gao, ma la go, steamed sponge cake flavored with molasses. White sugar sponge cake sad face, bai tang gao bai tang gao, baahk tong go, steamed sponge cake made with white sugar. Coconut pudding, yi ji gao ye zi gao, ye jap go, light and spongy but creamy puddings made with coconut milk, with a thin clear jelly layer made with coconut water on top. 
Mango pudding, Manguo Budian, Manguo Budian, Manguo Budian, a sweet, rich mango flavored pudding usually with large chunks of fresh mango, often served with a topping of evaporated milk. Tea service The drinking of tea is as important to dim sum as the food. The type of tea to serve on the table is typically one of the first things the server asks dining customers. Several types of tea are served during dim sum. Chrysanthemum tea Chrysanthemum tea does not actually contain any tea leaves. Instead it is a flower-based tisane made from chrysanthemum flowers of the species Chrysanthemum morifolium or Chrysanthemum indicum, which are most popular in East Asia. To prepare the tea, chrysanthemum flowers, usually dried, are steeped in hot water, usually 90 to 95 degrees Celsius, 194 to 203 degrees Fahrenheit, after cooling from a boil, in either a teapot, cup, or glass. However, chrysanthemum flowers are often paired with pu erh tea, and this is often referred to as guk pu, Chinese, ju pu pinyin, ju pu, Cantonese Yale, guk pu. Green tea Freshly picked leaves only go through heating and drying processes, but do not undergo oxidation. This enables the leaves to keep their original green color and retain most natural substances like polyphenols and chlorophyll contained within the leaves. This kind of tea is produced all over China and is the most popular category of tea. Representative varieties include Dragon Well, Chinese, Longjing Pinyin, Longjing, Cantonese Yale, Lungjin, and Biluakan from Zhejiang and Jiangsu provinces respectively. Oolong Tea The tea leaves are partially oxidized, imparting to them the characteristics of both green and black teas. Its taste is more similar to green tea than black tea, but has a less grassy flavor than green tea. The three major oolong tea producing areas are on the southeast coast of China e.g. Fujian, Guangdong and Taiwan. Tiguanyin, Chinese, Tai Guan Yin Pinyin, Tiguanyin, Cantonese Yale, Titgunyam, is one of the most popular choice of tea. It is originally cultivated in Fujian province and is a premium variety of oolong tea with delightful fragrance. Pune tea Cantonese, or Pu Erh tea, Mandarin, the tea has undergone years of fermentation, giving them a unique earthy flavor. This variety of tea is usually compressed into different shapes like bricks, discs and bowls. Scented teas There can be various mixtures of flowers with green tea, black tea or oolong tea. Flowers used include jasmine, gardenia, magnolia, grapefruit flower, sweet-scented osmanthus and rose. There are strict rules about the proportion of flowers to tea. Jasmine tea is the most popular type of scented tea, and is often the most popular type of tea served at Yum Cha establishments. The above teas are produced in most of China. Chinese tea bushes Camellia sinensis, are cultivated in the mountain areas of tropical and subtropical regions or wherever there is a proper climate, sufficient humidity, adequate sunshine and fertile soil. Chinese tea is classified in many ways, e.g., quality, method of preparation or place of production. The main processing methods include oxidation, fermentation, heating, drying and addition of other ingredients like flowers, herbs or fruits. These help to develop the special flavor of the raw tea leaves. Restaurants and pricing one aspect unique to dim sum is its method of serving in specialized dim sum brunch restaurants or tea houses. Here, dishes are pushed around the restaurant in steam heated carts, with servers offering the dishes to customers. Pricing of dishes at these types of restaurants may vary, but traditionally the dishes are classified as small, medium, large, extra large, or special. For example, a basket of dumplings may be considered a small dish, while a bowl of kanji or plate of lo mai gai may be considered a large dish. Dishes are then priced accordingly by size, with orders typically recorded with a rubber stamp onto a bill card that remains on the table. Servers in some restaurants use distinctive stamps, so that sales statistics for each server can be recorded. Menu items not typically considered dim sum fare, such as a plate of chow mein, are often available, they are typically branded as kitchen dishes on menus and are individually priced. 
When done eating, the customers simply call the waiters over and the bill is calculated based on the number of stamps in each priced section. As a means of attracting customers at less busy times, many restaurants have promotional periods on certain days, usually in the early morning or late afternoon. This typically involves charging a fixed price for certain dishes. Typically, the small, medium, and large items are all charged at the usual price for small items. The rule would not apply to extra large, special, or kitchen dishes. In some places, the tea fee may also be waived, or a discount be placed on the entire order. Where such periods exist the bill card would have a designated section that allows the items that were ordered during the period and to be easily recognized and charged appropriately. Another way of pricing the food consumed is to use the number and color of the dishes left on the patron's table as a guide, similar to the method used in some Japanese conveyor belt sushi restaurants. Some newer restaurants offer a conveyor belt dim sum. Format, similar to the conveyor belt sushi eating places. Other Chinese restaurants may not offer dim sum on moving platforms, and instead take orders, generally on a pre-printed sheet of paper, and serve a la carte, in a manner similar to a Spanish tapas restaurant. Prices of each dim sum dish may then vary depending on the actual dish ordered. This procedure may be used at less busier times in specialized restaurants, as it saves time and resources by chefs not having to anticipate which dishes would be ordered and prepare them in advance, though for the customer, it may take longer for the dishes to be delivered after ordering. Etiquette There are common tea drinking and eating practices or etiquette that Chinese people commonly recognize and use. These are practiced not only during dim sum meals but during other types of Chinese meals as well. It is customary to pour tea for others before filling one's own cup during a meal. When pouring tea for people on one's left side, the right hand should be used to hold the teapot and vice versa. A common custom among the Cantonese is to thank the person pouring the tea by tapping the bent index finger, if you are single, or by tapping both the index and middle finger, if you are married, which symbolizes the gesture of bowing. This custom is said to be analogous to the ritual of bowing to someone in appreciation. The origin of this gesture is described anecdotally. The Qianlong Emperor went incognito to Yum Cha with his friends outside the palace. While at Yum Cha, the emperor poured his companion some tea, which was a great honor. The companion, not wanting to give away the emperor's identity in public by bowing, instead tapped his index and middle finger on the table as a sign of appreciation. Given the number of times tea is poured in a meal, the tapping is a timesaver in loud restaurants or lively company, as an individual being served might be speaking to someone else or have food in their mouth. If a diner does not wish a refill being offered at that time, the fingers are used to wave off or politely decline more tea. This does not preclude taking more fresh hot tea at a later time during the meal. Leaving the lid balanced on the side of the teapot is a common way of attracting a server's attention, and indicates a silent request that the teapot be refilled. Fast food Instant dim sum as a fast food has come onto the market in Hong Kong, mainland China, Taiwan, Indonesia, Singapore, Thailand, and Malaysia. People can enjoy snacks after a three-minute defrosting or reheating of the instant dim sum in a microwave oven, in many cities. Street dim sum is sold from mobile carts and usually consists of dumplings or meatballs steamed in a large container and served on a bamboo skewer. The customer can dip the whole skewer into a sauce bowl and then eat while standing or walking. Dim sum can be purchased from major grocery stores in most countries with a Chinese population. These dim sum can be easily cooked by steaming or microwaving. Major grocery stores in Hong Kong, Philippines, Singapore, Taiwan, mainland China, Indonesia, Malaysia, Brunei, Thailand, Australia, United States, and Canada have a variety of frozen or fresh dim sum stocked at the shelves. These include dumplings, shaomai, baozi, rice noodle roll, turnip cake and steamed spare ribs. In Singapore, as well as other countries, dim sum can be purchased from convenience stores, coffee shops and other eateries. 
There is halal certified dim sum available with chicken taking the place of pork, which is very popular in Malaysia, Indonesia and Brunei. See also Cantonese cuisine Chinese pastry Cuisine of Hong Kong Dim Sim, Australian dumpling inspired by dim sum, with origins in local Cantonese restaurants. List of brunch foods List of dumplings Listing of dim sum Black sesame roll Cha Su Bao Duhua Egg tart Fun Guo Har Gao Jian Dui Rice noodle roll Shumai Spring roll Taro cake Taro dumpling Water chestnut cake Zalang References External links Hong Kong Tourism Board Guide to Dim Sum Dim Sum Guide and Photos Hong Kong Dim Sum Photos